Hello guys, this is Al from Opuso Channel. Welcome again to a new episode on how to. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video so I can get more videos done. Creating videos takes a lot of effort, so I would really appreciate if you can actually share and like the videos. And so as you can see, today I'm going to show you how to install net data on Dogger. This is the application that I like the most to see all the actual data in regards of the server and all the containers that I create with Docker's portainer on my server. Right, as usual, I'm going to use portainer. I'm going to create a script from the actual information that you can find on GitHub. Don't forget all the information links in the description below. I'm also going to get you a link for the GitHub page that I have. So you can actually go over there and grab all the information you need. As you can see, this one I just created, and this is what we're going to use for this demonstration. You, you can also browse many other, you know, uh, ready-made scripts. And I'm going to adjourn with all the stuff that I usually do on this page. So yeah, if you need any information, you can go there. And of course, don't forget, you can actually help and, you know, create more if we need to and comment if you got any problems on that page. All right. All right. So I just selected and I'm going to copy it and I'm going to go to my container and I'm going to create a new container. Go to the stack, add stack. I'm going to give it a name. In this case, it's going to be net data and I'm going to paste the actual code. Again, guys, you can find the code in the GitHub and information in the description below. This is the port I'm going to use. Make sure if you use it already this port, you actually change it make sure you change the one on the left not the one on the right so i'm going to de deploy the stack and i'm going to wait until the installation here we go the actual stack was successfully deployed let's go to the containers and as you can see that data's there and it's actually started right so while it's starting let's open a new tab let's put in the ip and the actual port that's going to be 1999 and as you can see that data is starting up this is just the installation. Uh, if you want me to go further, I'd be happy to show you around the actual app, but all the information is there. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna stop for a while, then resume the recording so you can see with the more data because it's just started. There is much data to show anyway. So for you, it's gonna be instantaneous. All right, so as you can see now, uh, more data has been populated and the stats are being recorded. Here you can find everything is on this server. For example, I got Portair, I got Yacht. In a second, I'm going to show you also the information on Yacht. And everything can be automatically accessed with the menu on the right side. Everything is in one page, as you can see here. So very simple. And, you know, you can actually find and search anything you need in this page. Here you can find the yacht, as I said earlier on. This is the actual portier. And let's open yacht so you can actually see. Again, guys, if you want to know how to install this, let me know. All right, so we are inside yacht, as you can see. And all the actual containers are here also. This is exact copy of the, uh, the portier. So even though this is yacht, it's exactly the same thing. Here you got all the information about the CPU in regards of yacht. And you can do exactly the same thing for portier and docker. All separate if you need to. As you can see, this is for Portena. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this small tutorial on how to install net data. Don't forget to like and subscribe. By subscribing, you help in the channel. And don't forget again to click on the bell icon to, to get notified. So I'll see you next time.